Duck and Brain here with another pickup video. Welcome to Fresh Picks, where we teach you how to pick your nose. <laughs> we went to a couple places on this uh, Labor Day weekend. Um, first, we hit up a, a swap meet in uh, San Fernando Valley. We got tired of the sausage speedway, so we're like, hey. We normally let's go try to. Try a new swap meet. We, we normally go to Valencia. Is it Valencia? Saugus, yeah. What is it called? The town is called Saugus. The Saugus. Saugus Speedway. The Saugiest. The town. Saugiest Speedway you've ever been to. So we we went to uh, a a certain swap meet a few times and we were like, eh, let's try a new one, like just to try it out. Yeah. This one we went to was a lot bigger than the last one, but I I think it had a lot less video game vendors. Yeah, there were a couple cool sellers, but but I don't yeah. know. I still like Saugus because sometimes you, you luck out and you get a bunch of good shit that day, but it is very yeah. hit or miss. And then there is one, a couple booths that from our old one that have uh, those two really good sellers. Yeah. That ha They always have like something for us. Yeah, like, for sure. Yeah. So anyways, uh, I, I got there first uh, and then you came in later, but yeah. I think you bought your game first, so why don't you go first? Okay, you got, uh, there are some cool sellers that, you know, we're willing oh, to, work, to work with you, and... When, once you uh, say what, what you got, I'll, oh, okay. I'll, I'll slide it in. <laughs> Why are you ducking me? <laughs> anyway, um, yeah, there are a couple cool sellers that were willing to make some deals with us, and he had a, a, he brought up, kept bringing out boxes of, like, plastic bins of NES games. Oh, yeah. But, I don't know, I didn't, I wasn't feeling like anything a lot, I just wanted to get a game or two, and you recommended I get this one. Street. What? Oh, did I? I thought you yeah, wanted one. Well, I do want it, yeah. It's oh. Street Fighter 2010, The Final Fight. It's neither Street Fighter nor Final Fight. It's not Street Fighter or Final but. Fight, but it has both in the title. Yeah. It's kind of cool. If you guys haven't played it, it's um, it's a platformer. Is it? It's like a it's Mega Man. Really, it's it, like a Mega Man platformer. Oh. It's punching and... Yeah, it's kind of... It's pretty cool. You called it a... What was it? You called it Shatterhand? Shatterhand is like the closest game I can think of. Yeah. <laughs> But hey, it was five bucks. Let me know if that's a good deal. <laughs> I feel like it is. Yeah, I'm excited. <laughs> it's a Street Fighter and a Final Fight game. How could I, I go wrong? I think I recommended the Lolo, Adventures of Lolo. Oh yeah, that, he was selling it for ten, and that's I think that's, that's a, a good, good price deal for that. Yeah. You're Anyways, right. I only got two games from there. I saw what did I see? I saw Ninja Turtles Arcade. He, he was Turtles letting it go for, for, what, 18 or something, I think he said? 18, yeah. Uh, that game has been going up. It used to be, like... Granted, we saw it at... 13, 14. Spoilers for a minute from now. We went to a game store after, yeah. and they had it for 19. Yeah. So it's so, like, I guess that's just the price, you know? Yeah, I guess it just but went up in price. But I, didn't I don't think there's anything much. wrong with us for assuming at a swap meet we can get cheap games, like better deals, but whatever. So he wasn't willing to go down in price, but he did pull out a... Like a couple more boxes of NES games, and I got two games from there. One of them is a game I mentioned we mentioned last time on Fresh Picks, uh, Rolling Thunder. <laughs> yeah. So this is, if you don't know what Rolling Thunder is, it's kind of like a run and gun mm. game. <laughs> nice zoom in on there. Yeah. Look at that clarity. You have to save her. I don't know. That's probably why she's there. Dora Anyways, uh, Rolling Thunder and uh, what's the name? Conan Viper are like essentially the same game, but like okay. three skins. So that's cool. I, I, you know, at first I wasn't gonna get a ten game game, but I saw this thing. I'm like, eh, why not? Yeah, not tight. Yeah, so that's one. And then the other one was Goonies Two. I have that one, and it's a good game. I think you'll like it a lot. So you said it was kind of like Star Star Tropics. Sort of. I like mean, trolley. it's. In that sense, yeah. it's like Star Tropics. It's exploration based. Yeah, you go indoors and then you end up in other parts. It's it's kind of like Metroid in that you explore this giant place, world, overworld, overworld, not, and you go in and out of doors and they lead you to different parts of this giant. Ha it's, you've seen the movie, right? Yeah. Uh, yeah. Okay, so it's like you explore underneath this giant abandoned house or whatever, mm -hmm. and then you like you'll run into people and they'll like tell you to do things and they'll be lying to you and shit like that. Like oh. so. It's like an exploration puzzle game. Like, it's fun. With platforming elements. You play as Mikey. Oh, cool. And you, and you find yeah. the other Goonies. Like, you're... Yeah, yeah. yeah. Data... Uh, was it Data? Yeah. And... 
<laughs> I'm blanking out on the names right now. Booty traps. <laughs> His brother's Brand or Brandon. Mouth. Yeah. Uh, chunk. Chunk. Truffle Shuffle. <laughs> Whatever, that's the same guy. Yes, the know. character known as Truffle, Truffle Shuffle. <laughs> so, uh, we... We were kind of bummed that we didn't get much, much at the spot there. meet. So we went to a local game, game store that opened up called Game Realms. Yeah. Highly recommend if going to Game Realms. If you guys are in the Realms. LA area, they are opened up by ex-employees of a, another game store, and they're trying to figure shit out, and they're doing a good job. Like, I feel like they're... I think their prices are very reasonable. Prices are fair. Like, they're they're, they're like, very nice, very polite. It, if not as low as eBay prices, probably a little bit lower. They get like, as close as they can, really. Yeah. And, and no, they have great prices. They give you coupons and membership stuff, and they're just really nice. So if you want All right, yeah, they, a nice, easy gaming experience. If you go there experience. for the first time, they give you a bunch of coupons, and it, it, it's worth it. Yeah. And we actually end up selling some games there, so that was cool, too. Yeah, I mean, I just uh, wanted to get rid of some stuff that I didn't play, so... Yeah. They, yeah, they do buybacks. They're great. So check them out if you guys are ever near LA. It's in Burbank? Yeah, it's in Burbank. Yeah. I was going to say Glendale, but they're the same thing. Whatever. Whatever. Yeah, Whatever. Yeah. Fight me, bro. Fucking Burbank, sick. Glendale. Same thing. I don't care. Burdale. Get a pumpkin. Glen Bank. Glen Bank. <laughs> <laughs> Anywho, I got Jackal. <laughs> Jackal's a great game. You should play it. Jeeps. You want to play it? Yeah, you drive around in Jeeps. Jeeps. It's like Jeep Contra. I don't know. <laughs> it's actually, okay, I would say it's more like Super C. The oh. top-down level. It's got the top-down level kind of feel to it. Do, yeah, you, yeah. do you like the top-down levels from yeah, Super yeah, C? Yeah. So it's kind of like that in Jeeps. And in it's Jeeps. co-op, yeah. like Contra. Oh, so you, yeah. you drive around in your two Jeeps and you just fucking shoot people. And you want to get prisoners into your Jeep. So yeah. you can, you know, you want to rescue the prisoners and get them out. Kind of like Metal Slug, I yeah, guess. Yeah. So, I don't know. It's a great cool. game. Yeah. It's really cool. I'll have to try it out. Yeah. I got that for nine. Nine, yeah. yeah. I thought that game but was cheaper, but I don't know. It is a very cheap game. I thought normally. it was like five or six or something. I think it's going up a little. It is like a five or six game, but whatever. Whatever, I mean, it's still good. Yeah. And you got a good I got. I used a coupon anyway, so it was, do that it was cheaper. No, I'm saving that for last. Awesome. <laughs> <laughs> and then I got for a game Zeta that I've, I've been looking for a while. I mean, I, I see it at like every game store we ever go to, but I just want a good, clean copy. Yeah. And a good price. And yeah, mm-hmm. I feel like... Yeah. I feel, look at that label. It's pretty common, so... Look, oh, 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 focus. Oh. Oh. No, yeah, look at that label, though. It's pretty, pretty good. Pretty clean. I can't wait to play this. Uh, it's going to be fun. It's like... Oh, you want to play it together? Yeah? If you want to. I'm, I'm, I'm sure. Know, whatever. I honestly, like, I don't remember much about it. It's except like that Zelda it's got two. daggers and wing boots. Mantras and monsters. I'll wait you. Oh. <laughs> I'm excited. Last but not least. I got blowjob boxing. <laughs> This is the, the Go, infamous uh, game where your guy that's, you know, what your your corner man, what do you call him? Corner man Stan, I don't know. Corner man Stan. <laughs> where you're... Your pep talk yeah, guy. Yeah, your pep talk your guy. Coach. Your coach. Coach. He gives, he, he, just look up Ring King and he has, you'll, you'll, you'll know what I'm talking about. He gives you some, some pepping up before the match and it makes me giggle. So I bought it because it's just funny. If you like blowing dudes, you'll like King Ring. Yeah, seven bucks. <laughs> seven bucks. Worth it for blowjobs alone. Okay, so... So, uh, did you get any games at the game store? Oh, did I? <laughs> I got a lot. Uh, it's my birthday this month, so uh, I got some money from my mom. Merry Christmas, I, you filthy animal. And as a 30-year-old, I thought it would be uh, good to uh, spend it on games. <laughs> I see no problem with this. <laughs> I got, first up, I got Trojan. Okay, I'll, I'll move for you, sure. <laughs> Trojan, it's like a platformer. It's, it's about it condoms. It was really cheap, yeah. It's about, it's about getting as many condoms as you can as a warrior. This guy knows, what, Trojan. This guy knows what condoms are all about. <laughs> Here, you take that I don't way. know. I, I don't, honestly, I don't know. I'm just going to play it. <laughs> yeah, let's, we'll it. figure it out. <laughs> yeah. We don't uh, we call our show Fresh Eyes for nothing. <laughs> I got a cart upgrade to Iron Sword. Label upgrade, boy. Label upgrade. That's your thing recently, is you're like, I want the best, best fucking copies of every pristine. game I own. Pristine. My other one is like super sun faded. Oh, yeah, so, no, I think yeah. good call. No, yeah. I, I'm all for your label upgrade shit. So that's now that's I just sell, been like your main thing. I, I can sell my sun faded Fabio <laughs> to a store now. I play sun faded Fabio in sun-faded attack mode. Sun faded Fabio. Okay. 
Next, I got Tasty. another shirtless guy. Uh, Amagon. Yeah, how did you ask for this game? Yeah, give me the one with the flexing guy. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> what game? The one with the flexing guy, please. <laughs> please. Yeah. It's fucking ripped. This reminds it's me of Altered ripped. Beast. How you, like, it kind of oh, is. You're, just, you're a guy, and then you get a, a power-up. Now you're a fucking ripped guy. guy. <laughs> you get another power-up. Now you're a dinosaur. <laughs> the natural <laughs> progression of things. Take this shit back. The, the person working at the store was... The person working at the store was like, Man, you, <laughs> what did she say? She was like, You guys like to collect or something? And I'm just like... I just like really obscure platformers, yeah. and I, I don't know. I just like games that are fun, okay? Yeah. Games that are silly. And she's like, oh yeah, that's the best. You just pop it in, you have a good time. This one. <laughs> Astonax. 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 All of your label art is really cool. Yeah. Like. All of my what? label art? Like, yeah. Like all the games you pick at. Shit. Come on, I want to see yeah. who's in the Pull bubble. it out a bit. There you go. Oh, she's in a it's, a, it's a girl trapped in a bubble. You gotta save her from the fucking she's dragon. She's wearing a shirt with the Astia Next logo oh, on it. She's got a skirt on. How weird. <laughs> it's a kilt. It's He's a Scottish. Kilt. <laughs> All right. <laughs> fucking Scottish hater. Fucking. That's, uh, that's wasist. That's wasist. Okay, so that's another five. I got a bunch of five dollar games. Just cause. Enough of your Cloverfield special effects over here, <laughs> spinning your game around. Uh, this one I had to get because I played recently in an arcade. Is that it's part of arcade it good? classic. I think it is. Okay. Don't you have this game? I've, millipede, I think anyone? I have centipede, but not millipede. I might have I think, millipede. I, think I might I, have millipede. I think I like millipede more. Then centipede, so I bought millipede. Good call. And uh, you should always buy things you like. It, it looks pretty crisp. I oh think, yeah, I all think of this the is one too. that has an alternate cover because I don't know. I saw this somewhere else, and the, the cover didn't look like this. So mm. yeah, no. Yeah, that... I'm pretty. It look, the art looks cool. Yeah, I like it totally. And it's a classic game, a uh, classic arcade game. So yeah, that's millipede. Mm -hmm. Ready for some. Uh, As view Ass call blaster it. Ass master. blaster master. Ass blaster master. Uh, this is pretty popular. You know what I like I about know. this label? They're like, what should we do to advertise our game? How about some blue blocks and a sprite from the game? Oh, that like, is, huh? Yeah, oh, wow. they didn't even draw anything. They're just like, let's fucking rip a sprite from the. Let's take a picture of our TV. Put a, put a target. And a target. Screen. And, and name so, it something completely different, because isn't it a completely different game in Japan? I, I don't think like it's it called. I don't think it's called Blaster Master. Oh man, we gotta come up with a name for when you do fun facts for that video, like oh, yeah. Fact Tracer and all that shit. <laughs> yeah, Faxter Master. <laughs> Master Fact. Ass Blaster, Blaster Facts. <laughs> we'll Master, figure it out. Master we'll, Fact Blaster. <laughs> <laughs> we'll do it in post. Well, yeah, we'll, yeah, we'll. <laughs> Tom and Jerry, last one. Uh, I got seven NES games from this store, and this is the last one. It's a uh, game it's about platformer. a mouse trying to murder a cat. Yeah. I never if played it. Little fucking Tom and Jerry is fucking go watch. Boomerang. <laughs> yeah, there you go. <laughs> I think I got some pretty good choices here for my taste in games. A lot of you might disagree, but whatever. Nah, man, I'm, I'm gonna excited. Have a lot of fun with these. Uh, and it was I did what, like it... 30 bucks? Yeah. Yeah. About. That's perfect. Um, you got a bunch of stuff you've been wanting for a while, too. Yeah, these are all just kind of like whatever cheap games. No, I, did, I know. I did really want Journey to Silius, and they did have a copy, but the label was kind of messed up. It was a little and messed I, up. And I feel like it, that's a game that I want, like, I really, really A really want. nice copy of. Yeah, and I, and I figure if I'm going to spend 30 uh, uh, it was like twenty. It was like twenty six. Oh, uh, twenty six. If I'm gonna spend twenty six dollars on a game, that shit better be fucking pristine. I'm with you. Uh, so yeah. Uh, last thing I got was for Genesis. Uh, this is a one of my favorite childhood games growing up on Sega. Uh, complete in box copy of Quackshot. A really nice copy of Quackshot. Too, yeah, might I add. The comes with manual. We're gonna open our. It comes with it, manual. It, it, <laughs> It came with manual. I go to college. I 
It has artist. It has a directed by my. <laughs> it has my friend uh, Donald. I like Donald. I like Donald. I like milk. I like ducks. I like sex. And it was complete in box. I like college. Com complete. Okay. <laughs> okay. Testy, so Victor. let's uh, let's zoom out here and show, kind of right. zoom out. The Everything hall. we got. The hall. This is our hall for. I'll put mine fresh. in a square. Yeah. Oh, this is the part of the video where my hand moves around a lot. Are you ready? Put your shit in a square because you care. <laughs> hey, that's pretty. This fucking bag. Oh, it's beautiful. Look at all those games we got for like a total of fifty dollars. <laughs> <laughs> Probably a little bit more than that, but it was pretty good. Under sixty, uh, under a hundred, definitely. Well, yours were like okay, maybe yours were like forty total. You can count them up right now. I, I we did get discounts because uh, we used coupons yeah. and we also sold some like shitty games. But these yeah. three were twenty three, and that was five. So I spent twenty eight. Yeah, uh, and twenty. Uh, we got a coupon with that, so that was fifteen. Five, five. So five. We're, <laughs> so we're at twenty-five here, and the re the the rest was like thirty. I don't know, whatever math. So like about fifty six between fifty and sixty bucks yeah. for all this. Pretty whatever. good. It's Pretty my good. birthday. I like games. Happy <laughs> Halloween. <laughs> I like games too. Okay, we'll see you guys next time when we do... We might hit up Oxnard uh, Swap Meet next time or... Yeah. What other ones are there? Leave a comment if you know of any good Swap Meets that still have games and we'll go buy them so you can In have them. In Southern them. California, preferably LA County or Ventura County. Okay, thanks. Bye.